Hi, this is Blake from NetworkingExamAcademy.com and today I'm going to show you how to convert um, decimal numbers into binary. I don't have my whiteboard with me because we moved, but um, I'm not going to let that stop me. So, let's begin. Alright, so first we want to set up our table. We're going to put the bits that the... Uh, you know, the binary numbers represent up at the top. So let's start here with 128 and then 64, 32, 16, 8, 4, 2, and 1. Alright, so I'm going to show you how to convert a decimal number such as 13 into binary. So first we see, does 128 going to 13? Um, it doesn't fit, so we have to 0. 64 is too big as well. 32 is too big. 16 is also too big. So, now 8. 8 is going to 13. So, 8. Let's see, does 4 going to 13? 4 plus 8 would be 12, so that also does fit. 8 form 2, that would be too big. That would be 14. So we put a 0 here. 1 fits perfectly. 8 plus 4 is 12, plus 1 is 13. Let's pick um, 17. 128 is too big, so is 64, so is 13. 16 fits. There's only one left over, so put zeros here. There's 17 in binary. Now let's do another number such as 175. Um, let's see here, 128 does fit. Um, 128 plus 64, that would be 192, so that would be too big. Now 128 plus 32, that would be 160. Correct? 160. So 160 plus 16 would be 176, so that's too big. Now plus 15, so this would be 168. This would be 172. This would be 174. This would be 175. That is 175 in binary. Now let's pick a real easy number. Let's just do um, 5. Doesn't fit, but too big. Four, three to one, there's five. Okay, um, let's do 255. I see this number a lot. This would be actually all the numbers. So 128 plus 64 is 192 plus 32. 192 plus 32. Do math here. You know what? Sometimes you have to do math. You can't do it all in my head. Four. Twelve. Two twenty-four. Now plus another sixteen. Zero remainder. So that gives us four. 240 plus 8 is 248 plus 4 is 252 this should give us 254 uh, and then this should give us 255 there 255 in binary let's do another number such as I don't know. 33. 128 is too big, so 64, 32. 1. We can do 64. That's an easy one. Anyways, um, I think you get the idea. So, that's how you convert decimal numbers into binary. Thanks for watching the video and you can visit me at www.networkingexamacademy.com 
And I'm also on Twitter at O Blake Erickson. Thanks. Bye.